Okay, I'm going to give everybody some tips on our 2000 Ford Focus. Removing this idle air control valve is a real bitch. Uh, the people, few people that I've seen on the internet, they say you can remove that plug uh, in the vehicle. Well, you better have tiny, tiny hands and super strong fingertips. After like an hour and a half of trying, I gave up and let's try something else. Remove the two bolts on the idle control valve, as they say. Then you can take that and push that to the driver's side up to where you see the plug right there. And you can stake that through and then hang the idle control valve down, uh, keeping the strain off of it, and have access to the tab to release the plug. And that took like 10 minutes to do that. So uh, keep that in mind. And I'm going to show you another tip here on reinstalling this idle air control valve, uh, which will save you possibly hours. Okay, and bear with me as I, as this 70 year old crawls out underneath this car, which has 200,000 miles on it. Original owner, it's been a great rig. Um, oh, now, when you install the idle air control valve, uh, the powers that be have you, by braille, try to put the screws in. Well, after trying that for about a half hour, I gave up. And I made these guide dowels. They're five millimeter. And this one's about the oh, seven eighths of an inch. Make yours about an inch long. And then thread that into the car body or into the air box. So these will be sticking out. Then all you have to do is take your valve and just slide that over the bolts, the studs. Now remember to leave it like a half inch out. Then take one out, put your cap screw in, and tighten it up, not really tight, but tighten up where it can hold it still. Then remove the stud, dowel stud up above or below, and then uh, insert your cap screw and it takes like 10 minutes if you do that. So happy motoring everybody and I hope this helps people. This is for a 2000 Ford Focus 2.0 liter dual overhead cam. So that's important that you got the right engine. All right everybody, take care.